ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕਾ ਖਾਲਸਾ ਵਾਹਿਗੁਰੂ ਜੀ ਕੀ ਫਤਿਹ ਪਿਆਰੀ ਸਾਥ ਸੰਗ ਜੀਓ ਨੇ ਸ਼ੇਅਰਿੰਗ ਟੁਡੇਸ ਗੋਨ ਟੂ ਬੀ ਅਬਾਊਟ ਫਰੈਂਡਸ਼ਿਪਸ ਐਂਡ ਰਿਲੇਸ਼ਨਸ਼ਿਪਸ ਫਰੈਂਡਸ਼ਿਪਸ ਐਂਡ ਰਿਲੇਸ਼ਨਸ਼ਿਪਸ ਪਲੇ ਅ ਵੈਰੀ ਬਿਗ ਪਾਰਟ ਇਨ ਆਵਰ ਲਾਈਫਸ ਆਵਰ ਲਾਈਫਸ ਐਕਚੁਅਲੀ ਰਿਵੋਲਵ ਅਰਾਊਂਡ देम ਵੀ ਸਪੈਂਡ ਅ ਲੋਟ ਆਫ ਆਵਰ ਟਾਈਮ ਇਨ ਐਫਰਟਸ ਬਿਲਡਿੰਗ देम ਐਂਡ ਕੀਪਿੰਗ देम ਇੰਟੈਕਟ ਸੋ ਲੈਟਸ ਸਟਾਰਟ ਮੈਨ ਫੀਲਸ ਇਨਸਿਕਿਓਰ ਵੈਨ ਹੀ ਇਜ਼ ਅਲੋਨ he is afraid to be alone he is always seeking for someone to be with someone to talk to someone to share his stories with someone to share his joy with someone to share his sadness with he is always seeking friends to feel good to be liked to feel liked and to have a sense of belonging but as you know and unfortunately not all friendships bring good experiences and further making the right choice of picking the right friends can be very tricky believe it or not friendships and relationships as much as they bring us joy help us feel secure and give us the sense of belonging they also bring the most amount of disappointment and grief be it at home in our social circle or at work this subject of friendship and relationships seems to dominate or play a very big role in our happiness some break our hearts some lead us to the wrong path some use us some break away as they move to new places or when someone dies or breaking away due to disagreements and when expectations are not met so the bottom line man either has friends which are not real not good or friends who are not permanent if i repeat man either has friends who are not real not good or friends who are not permanent and all this brings us pain now let's turn to gurbani and get guru's wisdom to help us deal with this subject guru says oh man if you don't want pain make the right choice look for true friends or real friends Guru is giving us choice guru says oh man you have the power of choice use your mind use your discretion use your wisdom and if you don't have all that turn to guru and seek wisdom use that wisdom to make an informed choice guru says if you don't want pain make the right choice look for true friends now who is a true friend the friend who is always going to be with you the friend who is always there to support you the friend who will never leave you the one who will never give you pain the one who will never hurt you in any circumstances the guru calls this a real friend gurbani guru says nanak kachdiya syo tod kachdiya means ye kachdiya means false kachcha jada hunda na false untrue नानक कचड़िया सियो तोड़ टूंड सजन संत पक्केया गुरु सेज ब्रेक अवे फ्रॉम द फॉल्स मेक द राइट चॉइस ब्रेक अवे फ्रॉम द फॉल्स एंड सीक आउट रियल फ्रेंड्स टूंड सजन संत पक्केया द रियल फ्रेंड्स संत सीक आउट फॉर सेन सीक आउट फॉर ट्रू फ्रेंड्स ओए जी बंदे बिछड़ा है ओए मोया ना जाही छोड़ ही सेज द फॉल्स विल लीव यू इवन व्हेन यू आर लाइफ but the saints will never forsake you guru says look for real friends the one that will remain with you forever the one that will remain with you here and hereafter now just to side track guru's definition of real friends are saints sadhus the ones that are connected to god the ones that will lead you to the right path the one that will help you in the journey of your soul now as per guru's definition this is a real friend a friend who will give you joy now guru calls the one who follows his mind and breaks away from guru and leads others to the wrong path a manmukh now let's come back the friendship with the real will bring us joy and the friendship with the false will bring us pain now we have a choice Now let's see what guru has to say for the guru says the relationship with the manmukhs which means the ones that are break, broken away 
the ones that lead us to the wrong path is pointless. Guru says a relationship with the Manmukh is pointless, it will not last. Manmukha Seti Dosti Thodaya Dinichar. Guru says the friendship with the Manmuks are only will only last a few days. Is a pratiti tut de vilamana hovayi. He says, Guru says such friendship will break away very quickly. And not only that, it's dosti chalanavekar. They will lead us to the evil or activities that break us away from God. That take us away from our path, the right path, the actual path, the journey of the soul. Guru Andar Devji says, the Manmuks are so shallow minded. They are so, so sorry. Guru Angad Devi says the Manmuks are so shallow minded. They will not be able to take you far. Nali ani dosti kade na veras. Jeha jana hai. Teho varte hai. Vekho koder jas. Firstly, the relationships never turn out right. As their behavior is limited to their awareness. Again, the awareness which is limited and as such it will lead them and you to the wrong path. Further Guru says don't waste time building such relationships as they are not here to stay. It is like drawing a line on water. That line will never leave a mark. As you draw it will fade off. Naliane dosti ve daru neho. Pani under league jo this not this that how not he ho. Iyane means foolish, arrogant, ignorant. Vedaru means big. Here the meaning of big means egoistic people. Guru says you build relationship with the foolish, meaning people who do not have love for God and do not understand the purpose of life. You build relationship with egoistic people. Guru says such relationships are useless. Firstly, they are not permanent or real. Like drawing a line in water, Pani under leak jeo, this that how na ho, Guru says, it will never stay. It will leave no trace or mark. Guru says, such friendships are useless. Useless, as useless as drawing a line in water. It will not stay. Now let's move further. The bond and the relationship and the worldly friendships, they are like trying to stick together. The bond of the worldly relationships and friendships are like trying to stick together stones or rock with mud. If I can repeat the bond in the relationship and friendships, the unreal friendships are like trying to stick together stones or rock with mud. Imagine using mud to stick two stones. In the beginning it looked like the stones are sticking together, but the mud will sooner or later get washed away by water. Guru says, Kuda gandana chalai, chikkada pathar bandha. Just like that, the relationship and friendship we have may seem to be sticking together well, but Piario, sooner or later, will break. The mud here reflects to the Maya or the selfish needs that stick people together, that bring people together. There is a bond in relationships and friendships. Once that needs are gone, the needs, the mud. Once the needs are gone, fulfilled, fulfilled or not fulfilled, once done, they break away. Now let's move further. Let's continue to understand the same Shabbat. Guru Arjan Devi says, Man mukhaan keri dosti maya ka sanband. The bond in these relationships is like the mud of needs and the selfish expectation. Once the needs are no longer fulfilled, people move away. Guru says, Vekh de ahi paj jaan kade na paayin band. They run away very quickly in front of our eyes. 
meaning once the needs are no longer fulfilled, people move away. Jitcher pen and kava de Jitcher pen and kava ne Titcher rakhan gand Guru says, as long as it serves their interest, they stick around and have a relationship. Jit din kachuna hoi Tit din bolan gand Guru says, the day they don't get anything or their purpose is not served, they will start cursing you and saying bad things. But the unfortunate truth, man, in spite of his experiences, in spite of the experiences of other people which he has seen and watched, he does not learn. He does not realize that this is that it is pointless investing in a relationship that do not add value to the journey of the soul. Guru says, O Murak, Ji ki saar na jani, man muk agyani andar. O man, you are so ignorant. You do not know the secrets of the soul, the needs of your soul. Now, one would say, so where do I find such a friend? Guru Arjan Dev Ji tells us in Gatha that he has found one such friend. Har labdo mitra sumitto. Sumitto means the best possible friend or the highest level of friend. Bidharana kade na chitto. Bidharana means break. Bidharana kade, the one that never breaks. Guru Arjan Dev Ji says that I have made such a friend. Who is the best friend anyone can find who will never break my heart in any situation? He's so great, Guru says. Janka asthal tol amitto. He says, Guru says he's dwelling. His dwelling is eternal and his greatness cannot be measured. Guru is referring to making God your friend and your soulmate. Again, we can make a choice and learn from what Guru is telling us. Learn from Guru Arjan Dev Ji and make God our true friend, our soulmate. Guru says, Soi Nanak Sakha Ji Sangha Kitto. Guru says, I have made him my soulmate, the friend of my soul. But unfortunately, Man never makes friends with God, with sadhus or with religious people. He does not invest time in his relationship with God. He only turns to God when he is in need or in trouble. And then he ends up blaming God for all his troubles and problems. He calls himself sophisticated and says the relationship with God and godly people is not his cup of tea. For some, it is not their type or their level. Just like all others, he looks for a relationship that brings him pain. Just like others, if I may repeat, he looks for relationships that will bring him gain or that will inflate his ego and status. He does not want to be friends with religious people. He does not want to be friends with godly people. He just wants to be friend with people that will bring him, bring him gain and that will inflate his ego and status. Guru says, Santanal ver kamavade, dushtanal mo pyar, agge pichhe sukh nahi, mar jammehe varo var. Guru says, they inflict their hatred upon saints and they love the wicked sinners. Guru says, by doing so, you will find no peace either in this world or the next. Mar jamme varo var, they are born and they die again and again. Dusht here means people with bad crabs. Guru says they will bring you pain here and hereafter. Guru reminds us again and again, but man is asleep in his ignorance. Guru says invest in your relationship with God. Guru Amr Ji says, Dushtana dosti nal santa vair karan Aap dubbe kutamb siyo sagle kul dubban Guru says man build 
prince invests in relationships with the dusht dusht people with bad living guru says be there not only you will suffer but your family your dear ones and your generations will suffer shor jahe tin hi shor jahe tin hi siyo sangi sajna siyo berana you develop friendship with the ones who will leave you and animosity with the ones who are always going to be with you guru and god now let's come back investing in the right relationship is the key to happiness time for us to reflect time for us to reflect back on all our friendships all our relationships and reevaluate them reflect on the lessons we have learned from our experience and the experiences of others time to decide which relationship we want to invest in the wise people they would invest in relationships that will last forever permanent relationships here and here after relationships that will bring joy relationships that will bring happiness relationships that will not leave us heartbroken relationships that will help us in our journey in the journey of our soul relationships with god relationship with god and godly people now we have a choice pyari saath sangho we saath sangho jiyo we have a choice we have to make the right one we have a choice make the right choice be wise do not let the pain and grief of bad relations drown us make the right choice we have a choice either to listen to guru or to listen to our mind the choice we will make the choice we make will decide on our experience the choice that we make will decide on the experience that we will have wise people say decide on the experience you want to have and then make a choice wise people say decide on the experience you want to have now once you have decided i want to be happy then go to the choice and say okay for me to be happy what is the choice that i have to make so if i can repeat decide on the experience that we want to have before we make a choice we still have time sadguru pali kare pul chuk di maafi wahiguru ji ka khalsa wahiguru ji ki fateh